it's Emily with Wonder and Wideners, and we are headed today to Magic Quest. We um, we just left Cece's buffet. I met Santa Claus there. I should have gotten a um, a video with him, but unfortunately, I didn't. Um, so we are um, gonna go do Magic Quest. It's like a, um, takes you on this adventure, and then um, there's also putt putt golf, and there's a mirror maze, and there's an arcade. So. We've got several things that we're gonna get to do while we're there. So, um, hopefully I'll get some video in there and you can check out that. It's only like $25.99 a person, which is um, a really great deal for around here. Um, and uh, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun for the kids. So, we'll see ya. All right, so we are in the arcade park. This is like all downstairs and we're about to head upstairs for our magic quest and we're gonna see um exactly what we're doing okay so we're gonna head upstairs guys Are you excited to go on a, um, a quest? Yeah, what quest? Yes. Yes. This looks like fun. It does look like fun. All right, so we are, um, we all officially have our wands. Let me see your wands. Remember, they gotta be straight down. No, bud, put it down. Just gotta go straight up and down. Okay, everybody's got their bond, and we are about to go into the training room. We are getting ready to train. We also have these books, the ancient book, the ancient book of wisdom. So um, we're about to check all this out and see um, exactly what we are going to be doing. I think yeah. only Anne Elizabeth and Thomas have um, wizard names. The rest of us chose our what regular you? name. Me too. The dawn. Me too, mommy. Oh, okay, you too. All right. So Me we too, are getting Dad. ready to get trained. Um, here it has. Um, um sorry. It has uh, your Magic Quest journey. It has some things that um, it tells you to do. It has some rules of Magic Quest. Um, it also has embarking on a quest. Things that you're supposed to do. So uh, I guess we will find out all of the things here in just a minute in our training room. Mountains during this cold season. A couple moves to go over, no rain or horse play. Mountains there tends to be quite a few people up here at times and we do get excited to find items and some things are on a timer and we ask that you do not run even though it's very tempting because it could be very painful if you run into someone. Take turns casting at objects. If two or more people try to cast at the same object at the same time, then you won't actually know who gets credit for that object and you might go through the quest and realize it wasn't you and have to do it all over again. Um, do not force items open. If you look here behind you, there's a chest. We have several of these throughout the kingdom. Uh, they will open when you cast your wand on them. If they do not, it means that either you are not on that quest or you have completed already. In which case, the chest will tell you. Inside those chests, as you can see over here, we have jewels in them. We do ask that you do not reach in and take anything out of the chest. If you do, the chest will close on your fingers, leaving your fingers behind, and the goblins will eat them later. <laughs> if you have a learner wand, those are the ones with the blue painted top. At the end of the game, there's a chest at the top of the staircase for you to put those in. Um, also, um, your books, if you do not wish to keep them, we ask that you recycle them. Also in a chest at the top of the staircase. Okay, the goal of the game, you're going to go throughout the kingdom, you're going to look for various objects. When you find these objects on these quests, you're 
going to get what's called a rune. A rune is what this wizard is holding. A rune gives you powers. If you have so many powers, you go on certain adventures, such as fighting a dragon. When you begin the journey, you'll go to the center of the area, and I'll take you there again a little bit, but you'll see stones such as this one here. These are quest stones. On the quest stones, there's a cue. You'll cast on that cue, and the storyline will begin. When it gets to this page here, it is touch screen. You want to tap start a quest, and this screen will pop up. These are all the different quests that you can go on. We do actually start on the one on the far left, only because it's the easiest, and it's the one that will get you familiar with the game. There are three realms in the kingdom. There's the forest, there's the village, and the dragon. The lightning will be, all of it will be in or around the village. The next one is the enchant. That one will be all in the forest. After that, the game will have you walking everywhere. The quest master, he'll be your guide. He'll be the one that shows up when you go to the quest stones and he'll teach you everything along the way. When you tap on your quest, this screen like this will pop up. Um, this is the lightning quest, the first one. At the top, it shows you what items you have to find. You have to go through and find all of those. At the very top will be your Magi name. Make sure each time you go to the stones that you check and make sure that it's your name. Sometimes people will walk past it and they'll accidentally cast on it. And if they do, it could be somebody else that you end up playing for. So just make sure that's your name. Down here in the bottom, this tells you how many minutes you have left before your time is up. If you're on a quest, and even if your time is up, it will let you finish that quest. Over here, it tells you how much gold you have. Some of the characters require you to pay them in gold before they will give you powers. The most important thing is that green accept button. If you do not touch that green button, the system will not know you're on this quest. And again, if you go through the whole thing and realize, wow, I have nothing. I didn't know you were doing this. You have to start all over and it wasted all your time. Book of Wisdom is going to be your best friend along your journey. It's going to give you all of the hints and insights that you need to find the items. And it tells you all of the quests you'll be looking for. Page 11 will be the lightning quest. At the end of each quest, you have to present your findings to either a character in a box or a character on a projected screen. If it's a character in a box, such as this one, you'll cast on that character. And the character will present to you your rune. You go to the box and they cast on the character and you don't have every item you need yet, then this will pop up telling you what you still have left to find. If it's in color, you already have it. If it's not in color yet, you still have to go find it. If it's a character on a projected screen, there'll be a crystal cluster outside of that character's location. If you cast on it and it turns green, it means you're good to go. You found everything. If you cast on it and it's red, you still have to go back and find missing items. When you complete each quest, your rune will be colored in, let you know that that has been finished. If you want to embark on an adventure, you'll just tap on an adventure. And say you want to go fight the dragon. So you'll tap on the dragon over there on the far left, and this will show you which quest you have to on first to get the powers in order to fight the dragon. And again, do not forget the green except button. Okay, now we're going to practice. I'm going to show you the best way to cast. You want to hold your wand so it's... Alright, we are getting our adventure started. Here goes Aunt Elizabeth. Alright, are you ready to get rolling? Yeah. All right, we're gonna press here, start a quest, okay? And then we're gonna choose, okay, let's see what he says. So Magi, it is the moon of lightning that you seek. If you succeed on this quest, you will possess one of the Magi's most powerful runes, also known as the rune of the warrior. To earn this rune, Listen closely to the ancient words of wisdom. First, seek out the armor, the shield, and the sword. And the 
Magi warriors come to and to your reward. From the man in the mist, a speedy and brave wing. Within thunder cave. Now go, mighty Magi. Seek out the lightning. The power of the skies shall be yours. Alright, we're gonna hit that green button. Can you hit the green button? Okay. Hit it again. Alright, okay. What did we just get? We, we which, are we just got the lightning rune. And now we are going to work on getting the enchant creature rune. Okay. Hi, are you having fun, Witten? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. All right, come on, bud. Olivia's one doesn't. Oh, there it goes. All right, guys, this is our last task. Okay, dude, have we gone in here? Did y'all go in the warehouse? You've been in here? There's one in here. There is? Yep. Have found a piece of the distress. How many wizards does it take to change a life bed? You have found many to change a life Yep, that's your last one. Oh, we gotta do the gargoyle. Let's go do the gargoyle. Where's that at? Um, I believe it's in the dragon slayer. Dragon's den. Okay. Alright, come on. Opens that door. What's in there? What's over here? Get that. I can't get it to open earlier. Well. Okay, so it's definitely an activity that we um, that you can do all day. Um, we've been here. Uh, for several, for a while now, over an hour already. We still have um, two bigger activities to do and then arcade games to do. Um, with our $25.99, it came with um, $2 a piece for the arcade part. And so we will um, we'll do that as well. And obviously we may add some more with that, but um, there are plenty of arcade games for the kids to play. and. Um, something that you can spend several hours here doing. So it's definitely been worth it. So we're gonna eat our sack and then we're gonna head on into golf. All right, we are headed into golf. We're gonna scan our cards so we can get our golf balls. Choose a ball. All right. This ball is out. Choose another. This ball is out. Choose another. All right, they don't have the blue. It's not working. Pick a different color. All right. They're giving the ones you've used. Choose a ball. Grab a club. Choose a ball, grab a club, and have an incredible... Choose a ball. Oops, this ball is out. Choose another. And last but not least. The love of my life. Choose a ball, grab a club, Thank you. That's mommy. All right, are we ready? Hey, here we go. We get to go golf. You can go first. And this? Witten was going Witten first. first. Alright, we're trying to get it in the hole down there, bud.
<laughs> there it goes, there it goes. Go hit it again. are just now leaving Magic Quest. We've been there um, for about four hours. Um, There's plenty to do for you to spend your day. Um, we did the quest. We did golf. We did the mirror maze. Wasn't sure we were making it out. Um, we played some video games. All in all, lots of fun. What did everybody think? What do you think, Daddy? Woo! It was awesome. It was hey, good. Olivia? Yeah? What do you think, Quentin? Awesome. Awesome. What do you think, Aunt Elizabeth? Woo! Okay, definitely a win for the family. Lots of fun. <laughs> Recommend 10 out of 10. All right, so we are officially leaving um, the mountains today. Womp womp. womp, womp. Um, it's been a great trip. We've had lots of fun. We've done lots of fun things. Everybody have fun? Yeah. yeah. Okay, 
day. Whoop, whoop. Definitely somewhere we want to come back to. Um, and maybe in the warmer months because it's been pretty chilly. And um, But a winter storm's coming in today. So we want to get back home and um, make sure we can take care of our animals and get ourselves nice and warm and cozy. So we hope you liked our video. Um, be sure that you hit that subscribe button um, for our channel and make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos. And we'll see you later, guys.